Welcome back to Silhouette Studio 5. In this video, we're diving into the Fill Panel, your go-to tool for adding color, gradients, and patterns to your designs. You'll find the Fill Panel on the right-hand side of Silhouette Studio. The icon looks like a painter's palette. Inside the Fill Panel, you'll see pre-selected colors, recently used colors, custom color palettes, gradients, and patterns. To fill any enclosed object with a solid color, gradient, or pattern, just select the object, then click on a color from the Fill Color section, or use the Custom Color Selector to fine-tune your own color using the Color Selector, or typing in HEX, HSL, or RGB values. Once you select a color, it will automatically appear in the Recently Used section for quick access later. You'll also find the eyedropper tool, which allows you to sample a color from anywhere in your design area. Click it, hover over the color you want, and click to apply it. That color will also be saved in your recently used palette. Want to tweak transparency? Use the transparency slider or type in a percentage. 0% equals fully opaque, 100% equals fully transparent. Now let's talk about custom color palettes. If you love the colors you're using, you can save them into a palette. Click inside the input box to name your new palette. Hit enter. Select a shape or swatch with a color you want to save. Click the plus icon to add it to your custom palette. You can add more colors at any time. To see the name of your custom palettes, just hover over the palette to see its name. To delete a custom color on your palette, right-click on the swatch and select to delete a single color. To delete the entire palette, right-click the palette icon to delete the entire palette. You can even choose which palettes appear in the panel using the drop-down menu. Your custom palettes and recently used colors are also available in the Quick Access Toolbar. Next, we will look at the Fill Gradient tab. This works just like the Fill Color tab, but with beautiful color transitions. Choose from preset gradients, customized by changing color stops, adding or removing points, and dragging sliders. Please note you cannot move or delete the outside tabs, but you can change their color. Rotate your gradient with the Rotate Gradient tool. You can also control transparency and input custom color values here, just like in the Fill Color tab. And yes, you can save your custom gradient palettes too. Now, on to the Pattern Fill tab. At the top, you'll find Default Silhouette Studio Patterns. If you've purchased additional patterns from the Silhouette Design Store, they'll appear in the Pattern subsection. Once a pattern has been applied to an object, there are a few options in altering it. Aspect Ratio defaults the pattern in its original ratio, or you can select Stretch Aspect Ratio, which stretches the whole pattern to fit as much as it can inside that shape. Mirror the pattern horizontally or vertically. Scale the pattern to make it larger or smaller, up to 500%. Pan the pattern to reposition it within your shape. Rotate the pattern using fixed increments, a slider, or a specific angle input. And that's the full tour of the fill panel. Use solid color fills to prep for cut by color, add visual pop to your designs, or simply organize layers visually. Use patterns and gradients for print and cut projects to make your designs really stand out. We hope this video helped you understand all the colorful power packed into the fill panel. Thanks for watching, and as always, happy designing!